Why do lovely flowers bloom from the cherry tree? Children of seven waking smile at the sun. Why do fragrant blossoms sway in the mountain air? Children of seven laughing run through the wood. Why do wilting flowers fall from the cherry tree? Children of seven dying to wake once more. All I wanna do is enter and take your money. All I wanna do is enter and take your money. Pile of skulls and bones, sticks and stones and weed and bombs. Running when we hit on the poison for the system. Pirate skulls and bones, sticks and stones and weed and bombs. Running when we hit on. Luck. One of the boys broke your charm? No, I did! Because it said that DC Universe films weren't as successful as the Marvel Universe films. An opinion that is unacceptable to hold. The frog told you that? Her brother told her that. But he is not here, and the frog is. Hey, I know. Put some Marvel Universe executives to hell. Hell, 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 hell. Go to that black website that offers nefarious deals a cause you can't bear to pay. Of course! Uber! Eh, they got surge pricing. That correspondence is cheaper. Run away! Run away! Oh, a busy intersection. That's a safe place to blindly dash into. Hi, I'm a truck! I'm Sagumi, nice to meet you! And that's how I learned my daughter was dead. I'm right here, Hajime. Killed by a careless driver texting at the wheel. He stopped in plenty of time. Sometimes. I can still hear her voice in the wind. Hajime, would you go to the hell correspondent, show the truck driver the doll, and threaten to pull the thread if he doesn't pay you lots of money? Oh, what? Like hell suddenly too good for blackmail? Look, I get it. Let's forget about hell girl and go on vacation in Hawaii. Yeah, Hajime, you know those movies where the cop swears he's retiring the very day the villain kidnaps his daughter and ties her to a bomb? Oh, yeah. Those are awesome. Okay, now, picture Hell Girl played by Dennis Hopper. No, oh, don't be silly. I'll make reservations. Do you know him? Do you know him? Sukumi? Do you know him? Do you know Sandro? Will you fund his Kickstarter? We're 6,000 yen short of our goal. There are t-shirts. Hellgirl, please. This is bullshit. I'm not funding a project with such a poorly defined business plan. Hajime, I'm, I'm sorry. Hellgirl wants something from me. I don't think she'll let me go until she gets it. Well, okay. But that t-shirt better be fleek. You better explain to me what Fleek is, because I'm still not a hundred percent sure. How, how much longer? There's a temple like the one you saw three hours away. Better figure out a way to stay occupied. I spun my little eye. Something beginning with jump scare. <laughs> is it a jump scare? Oh yeah, Hajime one, hell girl nothing. So, you say that you're doing an article on smaller temples outside of Tokyo? <laughs> yes sir, no ulterior, vaguely damnation related motives whatsoever. My card. Hmm, Shibata, Shibata, Shibata. I, I, I'm sorry, is my name- Shh. Shibata. I wonder if these are poisonous. <laughs> What's it gonna do? Make me more dead? Sir, 
doesn't it get boring living up here by yourself? Oh, my dear child, how can one be bored when you have the power of pure imagination? There is no life I know to compare with- Actually, fuck that. Fuck imagination. Oh, hello, Mr. Buddha statue. Can you come over to my house to talk about girls and eat ramen? No. No, you can't. You're a fucking statue. Hey, you guys got TV, right? What about the Steven Universe? Is it good? Oh, wow. It's so awesome. I wouldn't know. I have no TV. Fuck imagination. Sometimes to amuse ourselves, we give little children choking hazards. Your kid like candy? Here's candy. It's too big for your mouth, so pop it in your mouth. Pop it. Go on. Joke on it. Mmm, it's redolent of fennel. Oh, speaking of endangering child welfare, have you ever heard of... The Ritual of Seven Sending? Why do lovely flowers bloom? La la la, I can't hear you. Seven Sending? Thousands of years ago, farmers of this area believed the god of the mountain controlled their fortune. So every seven years, they would sacrifice a seven-year-old child to the mountain. You know, kill her. Oh, I do fragrant blossom stir. <laughs> that which doesn't kill me makes me stronger. Hajime, my visions of Hell Girl just started after my seventh birthday. Shinto believes the number seven represents good luck. So what? The kid was like a great big luck pinata? They had to bash her with sticks to make the luck fall out? How would that even work? With Snow White like, well dwarves, evil queen's catching up to me. There are seven of you guys. Let's kill Dopey. Like he's going to say anything. Dopey ain't saying nothing. Okay, you know what? Fuck imagination. And you two. Now, I'm not going to tell you the amazing coincidence that the person who built this temple thousands of years ago just happens to have the same last name as you. Shibata? Centuro Shibata. That which doesn't kill me? Kill me? Kill me? Thank you for coming. Fuck off. Oh, and if you see the Buddha statues splitting from their eyes as you leave, Ignore them. They just want attention. Goddamn Buddha statue drama queens. Uh, still no sign of her? No. And since I get paid whether Her Majesty deigns to show up for work or not, I don't care. Bet your stupid bird keeps a Wi-Fi password on a post-it. Pyroline cookie, go! Oh. Will you stop? I could be in real trouble here. Besides, their internet password's Katniss666. Duh. Hey, hey guys, hey guys. Human Resources says if I don't show up for work soon, they're reassigning all of you to Donald Trump detail. Trump detail? Oh my god, we've got to go find I. Th this is it. The waterfall, the cherry tree. Cavemen must live here. Look at this primitive game of Jenga. <gasps> Hajime, wasn't it winter a second ago? Global warming is worse than I thought. Haha! <laughs> Haha! Catch me, Centero! Haha! Hi, could you please just give me back my inhaler? I kind of need it to breathe and stuff. <gasps> of course! Hellgirl and Centaur were best friends! Hey. Hellgirl! Stop trying to look up my dress. It's pervy. Damn it! Leave us alone! My daughter has suffered enough! Oh, oh, have you suffered enough? Have you? Why don't we check the scoreboard for a second? No! Please! There's no Geodude down here! And I just realized Pokemon won't be invented for another 1200 years! Stop! Please! Centuro! Sugumi, I think you'll agree I've been pretty patient with this whole blacking out during important conversations phase you've been going through. I... I... I died! 
She died. You were buried alive! They threw you in a hole with your mom and dad, and you begged and you cried. And it was the true. He's our ancestor, and he killed your whole family. Yeah, well. No biggie. That's life. All part of growing up. Live and learn. That which doesn't kill you makes you stronger. That which does kill you gives you all the arcane powers of fucking hell! So we're clear. Stopping our supervisor from murdering someone counts as a business trip, right? Boss, not to question, but is this the one minute manager way to deal with the situation? Yeah, trying a new approach. Kill them all, and let Satan sort them out. That's gonna scratch the paint. Ow. Why do deadly shadow bolts kill my enemies? Children of seven ain't gonna take this shit no more. Bloody horrible. Oh, like I have time to worry about Meter. It's okay, Sugumi. She can't hurt us. You're seven years old. And that's lucky. It's okay. They're just a little wet. And underwater. And motionless. We are so boned. Bubbles. It's time to end this. After 24 episodes of making little more than cameo appearances in my own damn show, I demand an entire episode dedicated to me!